China has unveiled an audacious plan that could transform the future of space exploration by 2050. They aim to build a lunar space station, launch manned missions to the moon, and explore habitable planets in search of extraterrestrial life. This isn't science fiction, it's a meticulously crafted roadmap propelling China to the forefront of cosmic discovery. With a three-phase journey that includes constructing an international lunar research station and venturing into deep space, China is not just reaching for the stars, they're planning to touch them. These bold endeavors could redefine our understanding of the universe and humanity's place within it. So what exactly does China have planned, and how might it change the course of history? China's space agencies have laid out a detailed three-phase roadmap stretching from 2024 to 2050. This plan is not just about setting lofty goals, it's a structured approach to becoming a leading space-faring nation. Phase 1, 2024 to 2027, laying the groundwork. In the first phase, China aims to solidify the operations of its current space station and initiate manned lunar missions, They've already made significant strides with their Tiangong space station, which serves as a hub for scientific research and technological testing. Now, the focus is shifting toward the moon. Recent missions like Chang'e 4, which landed on the far side of the moon, have provided valuable data and demonstrated China's growing capabilities. Building on this, the upcoming manned lunar explorations will not only test human endurance in lunar conditions, but also pave the way for sustainable living off Earth. Phase 2, 2028 to 2035, building the Lunar Research Station. The second phase involves constructing an international lunar research station. This isn't just a solitary outpost, it's envisioned as a collaborative platform for scientists worldwide. The station will facilitate in-depth lunar exploration, including geological studies, resource extraction, and possibly even agriculture in lunar soil. What's remarkable here is the emphasis on international cooperation. By opening the station to global partners, China is positioning itself as a leader in fostering collaborative space exploration, which could lead to breakthroughs that benefit all of humanity. Phase 3, 2036 to 2050, Exploring Habitable Planets. The final phase is perhaps the most ambitious exploring habitable planets and searching for extraterrestrial life. This involves advancing technologies in exoplanet detection and interstellar communication. China's plan includes sending probes to distant planets, studying their atmospheres, and looking for signs of life. This isn't just science fiction. With missions like the FAST telescope, China has already contributed to the discovery of new pulsars and deep space phenomena. China's space program isn't just about reaching destinations, it's about answering fundamental questions about the universe. Understanding the universe's origins. One of the core themes is exploring the origin and evolution of the solar system. By studying lunar samples and planetary bodies, scientists hope to uncover clues about how our solar system formed. This could involve analyzing the chemical composition of lunar rocks or studying asteroid impacts. For instance, the Chang'e 5 mission brought back lunar samples that are helping researchers understand the moon's geological history. These findings could shed light on the early conditions of the solar system and, by extension, the formation of Earth. Additionally, the data may reveal information about the moon's internal structure and thermal evolution, offering insights into planetary differentiation processes that occur in other celestial bodies. Planetary sciences and exoplanet detection Another priority is characterizing planetary atmospheres and detecting exoplanets. By studying the atmospheres of planets within our solar system and beyond, scientists can assess their potential habitability. China plans to develop advanced telescopes and space probes capable of detecting Earth-like planets. This includes analyzing light spectra to identify the presence of water, oxygen, or other biomarkers that indicate the possibility of life. Moreover, missions like the proposed Earth 2.0 telescope aim to discover thousands of new exoplanets, enhancing our understanding of planetary systems. These efforts could significantly increase the chances of finding a planet with conditions suitable for life as we know it. Sun-Earth Relationship and Space Weather 
Understanding the dynamics between the sun and earth is crucial for protecting our technology-dependent society. Solar flares and cosmic radiation can disrupt satellites and communication networks. China aims to conduct comprehensive observations of the sun and the heliosphere, the vast region influenced by solar wind. By monitoring space weather, they hope to develop better prediction models to mitigate the impacts on Earth's technology infrastructure. These ambitious plans have far-reaching implications, not just for China but for the entire global community. China's emergence as a space power. By executing this roadmap, China is cementing its status as a major player in space exploration. This isn't just about national pride, it's about leading in scientific research and technological innovation. The country's investments in space technology could lead to breakthroughs in propulsion, materials science, and robotics. The advancements made could spill over into other sectors, driving economic growth and inspiring future generations to pursue careers in STEM fields. It's a strategic move that positions China at the forefront of next-generation technologies, potentially influencing global standards and practices in space exploration. In international collaboration and competition, the invitation for international participation in the Lunar Research Station opens doors for global partnerships. This could lead to collaborative missions, shared resources, and unified efforts to tackle the big questions of the universe. Countries that may not have the resources to mount their own lunar missions could contribute to and benefit from this shared endeavor. However, it also introduces a competitive element. Other nations may accelerate their own space programs in response, potentially leading to a new era of space race dynamics. But if managed well, this competition could foster innovation and bring about unprecedented advancements. Collaborative competition might drive technological progress faster than isolated efforts could achieve. Impact on humanity's understanding of the universe. Perhaps the most profound implication is the potential to answer age-old questions about our place in the universe. Discovering habitable planets or extraterrestrial life would be a paradigm-shifting event in human history. Such findings could influence philosophy, religion, and societal perspectives on life. These missions could provide insights into the prevalence of life in the cosmos, the conditions necessary for it to thrive, and how life on Earth fits into the broader tapestry of the universe. It's an exciting prospect that could redefine our understanding of existence itself. Moreover, the data collected might inform future efforts to safeguard our planet and possibly even colonize other worlds. China's comprehensive plan to expand its space exploration efforts marks a significant milestone in our collective journey to the stars. By laying out a clear roadmap and focusing on key scientific themes, they're not just aiming to advance their own capabilities, but to contribute meaningfully to humanity's understanding of the universe. This ambitious endeavor invites us all to look upward with renewed wonder and curiosity. As we stand on the cusp of potentially monumental discoveries, one thing is clear the next few decades in space exploration are set to be some of the most exciting in human history. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on space exploration and scientific discoveries. See you next time.